How's it going everyone? I'm gonna show you how to create a multiple language site. Don't worry, we promise you this tutorial will be completely painless. After you've created your main site in your primary language, hit publish and don't forget to add a description and customize the URL of your site. Now let's go back to the dashboard and make copies of the site, one copy for each language. To clone the site, just click the little settings icon and hit clone. For this tutorial, we'll only need one copy of the site for the Spanish version. Alright, so now it's time to go and translate the text. Click edit in one of the site's copies to start. You can either translate the content yourself or use a free tool like Google Translate for websites. We recommend that you translate the site manually so you can ensure the quality of the content. <laughs> Don't forget to check every detail. Alright, so now you have all your content translated. Go ahead and publish your site. Don't forget filling up on all the information on the settings panel, including description, name, and language preferences. You should also customize your URL. Finally, the last step is to link all the different versions of your site together and add a switch language option to the navigation bar. Go back to your original site. Here, an external link, we will be able to add links of your translated sites. Make sure you've set the option to open the site in the same window. Add external links to all of your site versions like this and repeat the process for every copy of your site. Here's the Spanish version of my site. Now I'm going to add an external link to the English version of the site. Publish the new changes and done! You now have a multiple language site. Click on the language name to change between the different versions of your site. Now, if you want to be fancy, you can add small flag icons for each language to replace the name on the navigation bar. To do that, we will have to add a bit of custom code to the site. Go to the link in the description and copy the code. Then, go to Settings, Advance, Custom Code, and then finally paste it on the footer code section. Finally, change the name of the external links and replace it with each country code. Hit publish and make sure to try them all out. Make sure to contact our happiness team if you have any other questions and really hope you guys enjoyed the, the tutorial.